of that region. Uh, and, and you're not, of course, hearing all the, the progress you have made and uh, all the reforms, um, you're not afraid of any setbacks. You're, you're introducing new reforms. Seems like uh, uh, you are on a, a track here. Are you never concerned that uh, uh, there will be forces that want setbacks? Who do you afraid? I'm engaging the public. As long as the public is behind me, I don't afraid and will make a change. Isn't I think that's a wonderful uh, end to this uh, conversation. I think uh, um, we are very privileged to have you here in Davos, uh, Prime Minister. I think also a uh, lot of business CEOs I see uh, here, and I know you met with them, uh, are uh, very interested in investing uh, in your countries. And I think you're also undertaking a lot of economic uh, reforms. Yeah, there are uh, lots of uh, reforms taking uh, place in Ethiopia, especially opening up the economy. Uh, we are opening state-owned uh, companies, which we have been considering as a commanding heights for years, including Ethiopia Telecom and um, Ethiopian Airlines. Uh, this opening up will bring uh, lots of capital and expertise to Ethiopia, and it will boost the pace of our economic growth. And we are open for any investors and we're also changing our ease of doing business. Uh, there is a strong team under my office, which is changing lots of hindering factors for investors to come and invest in Ethiopia. Uh, I hope in the next two, three years, we can see the biggest uh, change in investment flow to Ethiopia. Thank you. And uh, you can also count on the World Economic Forum to be a partner in that transformation. Thank you so much. Thank Mr. you very much.